Now to new information on the off-duty Milwaukee police officer shot in the third ward. He was wounded trying to help a woman being carjacked. That woman is a delivery driver who now says she is scared to return to work. She doesn't want her identity revealed, but shared her story with 12 News Courtney Sisk. It just has turned everything upside down for us. A DoorDash delivery driver found herself in the middle of a chaotic midday crime. It all started Thursday afternoon at the Shake Shack in Milwaukee's Third Ward. She doesn't have child care, so her three kids were along for the ride. I had to have my kids with me. I had to do what I have to do to pay my bills. I was already struggling. She parked to quickly run in and see if her kid could use the bathroom while she picked up an order. She took her keys with her. When I opened the door, they said, somebody's stealing your car. Police said a man attempted to steal the car, but jumped out when the delivery driver turned around. He dropped his phone in the process. I took the phone with me. Um, we were calling the cops to let them know that my car was just attempted to be stolen. It's what happens next that haunts her. He was there listening. He realized that um, I had his phone and he like lifted up his shirt a little bit and started charging at me. You could see that he had a gun and he was charging at me. An off-duty Milwaukee police officer was also in the restaurant and jumped into action, but the man shot the officer in the stomach. He is expected to survive. He truly saved all of our lives. If you had the chance to talk to the officer today, what would you tell him? Um, I would tell him thank you and that he's our hero. And I hope that it, we do get a chance to meet him. I feel like it's my fault. The harrowing experience now prevents her from continuing her job. I don't feel safe in Milwaukee. They're scared to come with. I'm scared to do it. In the meantime, a GoFundMe account is available to offset the financial burden on her and her girls. I just am trying to get through the next couple weeks while I'm looking for a new job, looking for childcare. In Milwaukee, Courtney Sisk, WISN 12 News. If you'd like to donate, that GoFundMe link can be found on our website, WISN.com. Milwaukee police have arrested two teens in connection to that carjacking, but sources tell 12 News they are still trying to locate the shooter.